Black Snapper, baby! We are still in the beautiful Berry Islands in the Bahamas, enjoying the clear waters and underwater life. Join us as we attempt to live from the land for a while. If you don't know us, I'm Emily, this is Fred, and we travel with our three little kids, Leanne, seven, Marceau, five, and Matisse, who is two. And this is Jeremy, our captain for the week and teacher of all things fishing. Living on the ocean has this way of making you more mindful of nature and our impact on the environment. For many sailors, it is a goal to leave off the land, take only what we need, we light less on food that has to be brought in from the mainland and generally lighten our footprint. It is definitely a priority for us, but if we're honest, we don't really know how to do it. So we decided to take advantage of our time with Jeremy to start learning. Lobsters you can find in the Bahamas are spiny lobsters. They get their name from the forward pointing spines that cover their bodies to help protect from predators. During the day, they hide under rocks or coral, so you have to look under ledges to find them. Locals drop these structures we nickname lobster condos in the hopes lobsters will congregate in these cozy hiding spots and will be easier to find next time. Hey! We're going spearfishing, uh, actually not fishing, but uh, lobstering. So we just anchored and there's a big boulder and it turns out there's actually a, a pretty big lobster underneath. Lobster cam. My belly. So there's lots of meat inside of here. So it's very important to take the knife and cut deep into the into the shell like that. That way you get all the meat out. A lot of people don't do that. They just twist the tail and they leave a lot of meat inside of here. So we're gonna try to get as much of the meat as we can. It is there a little bit, yes, Matisse. Look at that fish, Matisse. Lobster that Papa caught. Kong that Leanne caught. Coconut rice that Leanne helped make. And white rice for mussels. Wow. Wow. Wait, where's the conk? In here. With mango. Yep. That's conk salad. With mango. Yep. That's so tropical conk salad. Is the yellow? Huh? Is the yellow <laughs> mango? What? Yellow is mango. Is I want mango. You want mango? mango. Oh. All right, Captain, what's the plan for today? All right, plan is go out there, do a little sailing, uh, catch as many fish as we can, and have an awesome time. Here we go.
these are electric. It makes so when you're when you're when you're very deep to try to reel it all the way up it takes a long time. It's nice thing. So this is the light. So we're gonna fish very deep. So down at that depth, there's no light. So when you have something that flashes like that, they can see it from a long ways away. All the fish will come in because they think it's food, and then they smell the food and then they bite it. Man, are you ready to bait the hooks? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What what fish would you like to catch, Leanne? I don't know. I don't know what fish. <laughs> How about a black snapper? It's a really good fish. Okay, dropping. Okay. Oh, we're on the bottom? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Moving. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. They're biting, yeah, biting. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Oh. On the right spot. Look, we have, a, we have something big. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, it's struggling to pull it up. Oh, oh, Bob, Mama. What? Look, this will be a big guy. We're at 120 meters, 123, 124. It's not reeling it again. Either we caught a fish, or, or we caught a leg, or we caught a fish on the fish swam under a leg, and then the hook got stuck. Pretty good. Yeah, chicken ramen, the fisherman's meal. Careful, there's a chicken. There's a chicken. That's something big. Woohoo! Wop, 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 wop. Holy cow. I really felt good about my baiting. Okay, coming out. Six. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Henry up. Let me see. Yeah! Black snapper, baby. Woo! Yeah! yeah. That's it. All right. Cool. Oh, that's a yeah. bear. Some of the crew isn't enjoying being stuck in a moving boat so much. We got it. We'll scale it, and we'll put it on the put it on the grill and have some good have some good dinner. This is the Caribbean barbecue. Yeah. Leanne really likes ice, fish ice. <laughs> so we want to put it inside also. You know, like a cooking show now here. Huh? That's cooking with Jeremy. That's it. Woo! Our barbecue master pieces. Oh, yum. That looks delicious, isn't it? That is your special fish, that's your strawberry grouper. So right now I'm serving this. Then you can have the ice later, okay? Well, while talking about living from the ocean, you might have noticed a salad bar at the back of the boat in some videos. I was curious too, so I decided to find out more. This is a hydroponic garden. What does that mean? So that means there is nothing but water and uh -huh. hydroponic nutrients in here. Okay. So most most vegetables, fruits and vegetables need to grow out of soil. This doesn't use any soil at all. Oh wow. The roots only grow down inside of the water. It has all of the nutrients, the moisture, the water, the everything it needs to grow. I've had Pretty good success growing a wide variety of things. So what do you have right now? What's your favorite to grow in there in the Bahamas? So right now what I've got in here, I've got three kinds of lettuce. I've got arugula, I've got butter lettuce. This is this is romaine lettuce. This is butter lettuce or, or uh, bib lettuce. And then right back here, we've got some arugula. We've got some fresh uh, rosemary here. We've got cilantro. Mm. So I can make some fish ceviche. Yeah. We've got, down here we've got dill, which is also very, very good on the fish. It's getting fluffy. Yep, it's getting oh. big. We've got some jalapeno peppers here. This is perfect because we can grow this when it's the right size. We cut it and we have it for dinner. Oh, yum. Yep. 
I thought that garden was a great addition to be even more self-reliant for food. I hope you've enjoyed this episode as much as we've enjoyed our time in the Bahamas. If you have, please subscribe and join us next time. No, to go away! I want to. I really want you. I really, really want you.